We're going to have a look at the WPS500 looking at intake manifold pressure during cranking. Let's run the animation and discuss how we connect, what we're looking for in the measurement, and the kind of faults we may experience. So here we have four-cylinder engine, and we're cranking, so we're going to remove the fuel pump. We don't want any fuel into the intake. Uh, ignition as well, remove that. So this engine now will not fire, will not start. So pressure transducer, switch on. Make sure that the test port is open to atmosphere. This is where it runs through the three ranges and calibrates. And for this test, during cranking, we want range three. Connect that to Picoscope and then connect to the intake manifold and crank the engine. You see there that we've got pulsations from the intake as a result of valve open and close events. Now here we have a fault. Look at the gasket on the intake manifold there. We've got a split there and you could tell by the sound of the engine how that was cranking that something is not right. Let's take a look at the waveform. We've got the two views of the intake manifold you saw in the uh, animation where we had the cracked intake manifold gasket. So this is the full view here and there's definitely um, repetition but with this event here, something is not right about the cranking pulsations in the intake manifold. So let's have a look at uh, full view for a zoomed in section of the waveform. Right, so we're always looking for uh, uniformity. So we've got an inlet manifold pull there and a pull here and a pull there. And now here we are missing a pull event. It's almost like we start to pull down here and then we don't quite make it because at that point on the intake manifold, we've got um, intake stroke, but with no seal within the manifold. So we can't pull this negative pressure. And then of course the pattern repeats. So the key here always is looking for uniformity within the waveform. With minimal intrusion, attaching the pressure transducer to the intake manifold will reveal numerous characteristics about the intake efficiency an intake pull for each individual cylinder prior to combustion.